everyone and welcome back to my channel. As you can see, we're not in New York at the moment. We're actually in Paris. So welcome to my Paris vlog. We're here for the weekend. We just flew out um, last night. So last night from New York, but we got here this morning. It's Friday now. And yeah, we've decided to come here for the weekend. We're going to Ireland actually for work next week. So we decided to do a little stopover on the way and we thought Paris would be a good shout because we both haven't been here in a while. I've only ever been in Paris once and it was for a school tour about, I'd say five years ago. But to this day, it is still one of my favorite trips of my life, I'd say. We had such a good time and I just like had such a good feeling here. I absolutely loved it. I got the same feeling here as I got when I went to New York the first time. So hopefully it's the same this time. Um, I think it will be though. I just, I really like the vibe here. So yeah, as I said, we just arrived here this morning. We got to our hotel a few hours ago and we just kind of had a little quick nap and got ready because we were wrecked. It was like an overnight flight. But we're just about to head off and do a bit of exploring now. We're going to go get some food and we're going to go to the Eiffel Tower. That's kind of our first stop on the list. So I'll quickly show you what I'm wearing and I'll show you the hotel as well. We have a really cool balcony so I want to show you that. This is our lovely room. We're staying in the Hotel Chateau Frontenac. I hope I pronounced that right. So yeah, it's lovely and spacious. All our stuff are just set up here and there's like a little wardrobe area in there which is very handy and here is the bathroom Erica's just getting ready uh, trying to get ready she couldn't get up out of her nap uh, and then this is the stunning balcony wait till you see oh my god look at the view and look at the size of it it's so big it's a little noisy now so I hope you can hear but yeah like the perfect Paris view this is just a quick look at what I'm wearing it's kind of hard to show it because nowhere is long enough but it's this lovely kind of midi dress that I got off ASOS Funny story actually, we were on our way to the airport. If you follow me on Insta stories, you'll have seen it. And like it still hadn't arrived and I was so sad because I really wanted to wear it here. And we saw the UPS guy across the road and me and David like ran after him. And luckily he had it. So I got it just in the nick of time. But I love the polka dots and I love the shape of it. It's kind of backless as well, if you can see that. And it's really hard to show you now, but it's midi and it has a slit and I just love it. So I just have this kind of sleek ponytail, a red lip and my white boots. But I'll give you a better look at it later. Hopefully Erica will do a shot for me maybe. But yeah, we're gonna take off now and go to the Eiffel Tower. I'm so excited. Okay, we finally got some food anyway, as you saw. But now we are doing some shopping. We're on this street. I'm not sure the exact name of it, so I'm gonna put it here. Um, but yeah, it has lots of like nice designer shops like Chanel and YSL and Fendi. So we're just like browsing and window shopping, which I love to do. And yeah, it's just a very kind of Parisy thing to do. <laughs> hotel now and it's the end of day one we're absolutely wrecked because we didn't really have a proper night's sleep last night and our time zone is kind of all out of it but as you saw we just finished off the nights getting some drinks in some hotels nearby and we went to the four seasons which was absolutely stunning and then we went to the hotel next to that called paris de gaulle's i think and yeah that was a nice way to finish the day so we're gonna get some rest now uh, because tomorrow we have a really action-packed schedule planned we have loads of places we want to see so we're gonna try and get up early and fit them all in so yeah, for now I'm gonna go to bed and I will bring you along tomorrow as well. Okay guys, it's day two and we're just up. We actually slept in a tiny bit. But we just did our makeup and hair and ordered some breakfast. We just got some coffee and fruit because we're actually going for breakfast to another place after this. We have so many places we wanna get through in the time we're here, so we're making due. We decided to take it out in the balcony because hey, when are we gonna get to have breakfast on a Paris balcony again? So this is what we're dealing with. I think I have a bit of a color scheme going on this week. <laughs> Red, red, and more red. <laughs> and the laptop thrown in there too because I was editing my video that's going live today, this morning. I must try and find some good Wi-Fi now to put that live. I think you're gonna really like it actually. In the video I'm showing you exactly how I create this kind of dewy, glowy look that I've been wearing so much lately and loads of you have requested it. I'd say it's been my most requested video in a long time. So yeah, I'm finally putting that live today. So I'll link it in the description box if you haven't seen it already and hopefully you'll find it helpful. And just like that, we are ready again, all set for day two. Erica has told me that I look like a French spy. 
Spy, which is definitely not the look I was going for, but I'm feeling this look. I just got this new red beret, especially for this trip, because I love berets and I love red. So of course I wanted to wear one while I was in Paris, so I got this new one off ASOS, and I'm wearing this really cool denim trench coat. I got this off Pretty Little Thing, and to be honest, I was a little bit worried about it. I wasn't sure how it would look, but I thought it looked really cool on the website, and I thought it'd be nice for this trip, so I got it. And yeah, I'm just wearing that with leather leggings and red boots, and this is one of my vintage-inspired pair of sunglasses that I got off Amazon. If you remember, I got these for my trip to Miami last year, so I brought them all to Paris as well. And yeah, we're all set to go now. We're gonna head off to a cafe called Cafe de Flore. Erica has been there before and she said it's lovely, so we're gonna go back. And apparently they do good coffee, which is definitely necessary for today. So yeah, all set now. Erica is rushing me as usual, even though she's just ready herself. I'm ready. Right this is Erica. Like she's ready like two seconds before me, and then she's like, "Come on, I've been waiting for you." Oh, no. What do you look like today, Erica? A spice girl or something? I feel cool in your sunglasses. Yeah. <laughs> this is classic big sister trying to be like small sister. It's usually the other way around. Uh, yeah, well, well, you're more like trendy than I am, I think. Yeah, I'm cooler. <laughs> I have to though. Does I have too much though? Are you sure? I don't know, Erica. What do you think, people? Well, I think it looks okay. <laughs> okay, come on, let's yeah, go. So. Okay, so we just finished off some coffee in Café de Flor. It was really nice there, such a good people watching spot. And now we're just walking around St. Germain. This is like supposed to be a nice, cool, um, kind of busy area. And we're gonna go to the lure of the next to see that and yeah. made it to the Louvre, or Louvre, I don't really know how to pronounce it to be honest. The waiter was trying to tell us, but neither of us knew. But it's so nice here today, it's really quiet. It's like, not too busy, which I'm delighted about. And it's just really peaceful and calm. I haven't been here since my school tour in like 2011 or 12, so it's cool to see it again. We're not gonna go in this time, because we're a bit stuck on time, as you know, but um, yeah, we're just gonna chill around here for a while. Eric is just over there doing a bit of vlogging too. Come on, Ken, you can do it. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, this is scary. Down. <laughs> no, like point at it. <laughs> no, up. Down. Keep going down a little bit. Okay, you got it. Our next stop we're dying to find this place with the little white and black um i don't even know what you call them they're like little stubs on the ground and there's some taller ones over there we've seen photos of some people here and we just thought it'd be cool to come here i think it's called the garden de royal palace or else garden de palace but i'll put the name on the screen and now we are going to go get some food i think we're gonna do some lunch i feel like we were just at the cafe but we're starving again so we're gonna make our way over towards the ferris wheel and yeah just kind of stroll around and take our ease for the rest of the day change because we're going for dinner and I wanted to just finalize some things in my video that will be going live when we come back probably because it's still uploading so I just changed into this top that I got from Pretty Little Thing I really like it it's kind of like a leather blazer and it just buttons at the front here and I just touched up my makeup and took off the beret so yeah we're gonna go now we're going to a place called Pink Mama I think it's called hoping to get in they don't take reservations and it's supposed to be super busy but hopefully we'll get in and yeah I'm ready for more food <laughs> Morning. 
uh, we're just stopped now and ready to go because we want to go do some exploring before we leave. We've one or two things left to do um, and our flight's not till half two so we're just going to make the most of the morning. It's a little bit dull here this morning so I hope it picks up a little bit but yeah, I can't believe the trip's over already. That was like the quickest trip. I look like such an egghead, oh my god, <laughs> bring my hair forward. But yeah, that was the quickest trip ever, I can't believe it's over. I mean I know it was only two days but still it flew by. But I'm excited to be going to Ireland today. We fly into Cork, um, but the snow is so bad. Like my mom rang us yesterday and was like, I don't think we're gonna be able to collect G because there's like six inches or I think they said eight inches of snow on the driveway. I so I don't know. They've been like housebound for the last three days. So hopefully we'll make it home today. I think it'll be fine to get to Cork, but I don't know how it'll be to get to Kerry from Cork. Um, but yeah, fingers crossed. Today I'm wearing red again. I swear I didn't plan all my outfits to be red, but two of my outfits that I wanted to wear didn't work out. So it just turned out that everything I wore was red in the end, but I don't mind, I like red anyway. I'll quickly show it to you now in the mirror. So this is it today. It's this red kind of leather dress from Pretty Little Thing. I'm so obsessed with it. I adore anything red and anything leather. So yeah, when I saw this, I had to have it. And then I just have this check coat over my shoulders. I'll probably tie it up when I leave. And just a pony again today because my hair is a little greasy. I had a nude lip on, but I changed it to red there. I just love a red lip with a red dress. But yeah, this is what we're wearing today. And then I'll come back and change into something comfy for the airport. So, so yeah, I think we're going to go to the Eiffel Tower first again. And then we're going to go to the Arc de Trump. And we might grab something to eat as well, hopefully. So as always, I'll bring you along. De Paris n'importe où, bras, bras sur, en j'entends des chansons, bras dessus. De Paris n'importe où, bras, bras sur, en j'entends des chansons, bras dessus. Okay, and we are back to the hotel again. We just packed up everything and we're ready to go. We had a lovely uh, breakfast in Laudery. It was actually so, so nice. The service was really, really nice there and the food was good too. And we just went to see the Arc de Trump, as you saw, and that lovely view of the Eiffel Tower on that street. And we got some cool shots, so that was nice. And yeah, it's actually really rainy and miserable today. So it's kind of making it a bit easier to leave. So yeah, we're gonna head to the airport now. Yeah, I just changed quickly, I'll show you. I put this hoodie on. Absolutely love dressing up, but I'm definitely happy to be back now and comfy out for, for the next few days, hopefully. So I actually just got this hoodie from Pretty Little Thing, so I'll show it to you in the mirror. It's actually a lovely colour and lovely fit. So yeah, it's just this plain hoodie. I'm just wearing black jeans with it. So I'm just going to put my aviator over this now and be nice and comfy for the flight. So yeah, we're going to head now. I'm kind of sad, but I'm looking forward to going to Ireland and seeing Vogue. <laughs> Okay, and we are ready to board. Two of us are ready to fall asleep. I can't wait to sleep this whole journey. But yeah, I want to leave the vlog here now. Um, so thank you so much for watching. Uh, Erica has a vlog too, so you'll have loads of Paris content and we have loads of Instagrams as well and stuff. So yeah, I hope you enjoyed all the places that we've showed you and the outfits. I'll link everything below in case you're wondering about anything. And yeah, don't forget to leave a thumbs up too if you enjoyed it and I will see you in my next video. Bye. Bye. Bye.